Hey everyone, Edwards here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to easily fix your Xbox controller driver errors in Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to turn on the Bluetooth in Windows 11. To do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure to click on Bluetooth and devices on the left pane. Now, as you can see, the Bluetooth section is turned off, so if you want to turn it on, just toggle the section to on. As you can see, if your controller is turned on, you'll see a message that says new Bluetooth game controller found. So just make sure to click on the connect button or simply click on the blue add device button in the devices category. In the add a device window, you have to choose the kind of device you want to add. So click on Bluetooth and as you can see, the Xbox wireless controller is already showing up. So click on it and soon you will see that it will connect. And now your device is ready to go. Now you can press on the done button, close the settings window and enjoy your new controller. Another useful solution is to update Windows 11. To do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure to click on Windows Update on the left pane and then on the right side click on the blue check for updates button. Now Windows will try to find the best possible updates for your PC and install them automatically. After installing these updates, make sure to restart your computer and check if the issue still persists. Another great solution is to update the Xbox controller drivers. To do this right click the Windows button then select Device Manager from the list of options. Now depending on your connection with your controller, it can be either Bluetooth or it can be directly via USB. So if your controller is connected via Bluetooth, make sure to expand the Bluetooth section by double clicking on it in Device Manager. In here you'll see the Xbox wireless controller, so right click on it and afterwards select the update driver option. Now just click on search automatically for drivers and Windows will try to find the best possible drivers for your PC. Otherwise you can also click on search for updated drivers on Windows Update. In case there are any drivers available, Windows Update will try to find them and install them automatically. Otherwise, if your Xbox controller is wired, you can scroll down until you find the sound, video and game controllers, double click on it to expand it and afterwards search for the Xbox controller, right click on it and select the update driver section. You can do the same by searching automatically for drivers and again you can search for updated drivers on Windows Update. Another useful solution is to roll back or uninstall the Xbox controller drivers. In the same device manager window, make sure to access the Bluetooth section or the sound video in game controllers depending on your type of connection. So if your connection is Bluetooth, for example, just expand it and then right click on the Xbox wireless controller and select the properties option. In here, choose the driver tab and afterwards you'll see that you have many options in here, including the rollback driver. So if the device fails after updating the driver, you can just roll back to the previously installed driver, so click on the rollback driver button. Otherwise, if this step doesn't work properly, you can also uninstall the device. So if you click on the uninstall device button, you can also confirm again by pressing on the uninstall button. Afterwards, just restart your PC and Windows will automatically reinstall your drivers. And that's it. Plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.